students welcome to benzene chemistry classes so in the previous video we had discussed about zwe mains questions and now also we'll discuss about the few more questions of zwe and this question is asked in the year zwe mains examination 2018 and this question is asked in zwe mains 2017 so these two are the simple problems let us solve very much easily so let us read the question which type which type of defect has presence of cations in the interstitial site so the question is in which type of defect the particles the especially cations are present in the interstitial site interstitial site so they have mentioned cation as they have mentioned cation here the cation and anions means the compound is ionic compound ionic solid for ionic solid there will be no vacancy defect isn't it so the vacancy defect and interstitial defect are for the non ionic solids and for ionic solids there will be franken defect and schottky defect and they, it may be a metal deficiency defect also so let us see in which defect the cation is present in interstitial site we know that in a crystal structure in ionic crystal cation anion cation anion like this the arrangement will be there isn't it so anions are surrounded by cations and cations are surrounded by anions negatively charged particles are surrounded by positively charged particles and positively charged particles are surrounded by negatively charged particles in frenkel defect what happens the small sized cation leaves its own site and it occupy interstitial site means in frenkel defect the cations are present at the interstitial site so this is our answer frenkel defect is our answer so then what is schottky defect in schottky defect equal number of cations and anions are removed from the crystal because of that density decreases in frenkel defect density remains same so if you want to know more about the frenkel defect and schottky defect please watch my previous video okay next come to the next the answer is frenkel defect here here this is also simple one a metal crystallizes in fcc structure they have given a metal that metal crystallizes in fcc structure phase center structure if the edge length of its unit cell is a the edge length of fcc unit cell is a the closest approach between two atoms in the metallic crystal system will be and what you have to calculate is they have given fcc unit cell here we have got a fcc unit cell in that fcc unit cell first let us see where the particles are present so let us take this is our fcc unit cell this is our fcc unit cell the particles are presented at the corners isn't it and also the particles are present at the center of each face center of each face now what we have to calculate is the closest approach between two atoms the closest approach between two atoms here where we can calculate closest approach here the particles are along the edge so this is the distance between the particles will be this to this will be a the closest approach will be a here here the particles are also touching along the face diagonal here the particles are touching along the face diagonal half of the face diagonal here the particles two particles are touching along the half of the face diagonal if we calculate the length of the face diagonal half of that will be the closest approach in between a and half of this that will be which one is the lesser value that will be our answer so here this is directly as a the closest approach between the corner particles is a and here what is the length of face diagonal how to calculate this let us take it as a this point as b this is our c and according to pythagoras relation how we can calculate take this as b the face length of face diagonal is equals to b b is equals to ab square plus bc square a square plus a square isn't it ab is also a bc is also a as they have given length of the unit cell is a so this is equals to 
टू ए स्क्वेर इज इक्वल्स टू बी स्क्वेर वट इज बी बी इज इक्वल्स टू बी इज इक्वल्स टू इफ द स्क्वेर कम्स दिस साइड इट बिकम्स रूट टू ए हियर दिस वैल्यू इज द टोटल लेंथ बिटवीन फ्रॉम द पॉइंट ए टू पॉइंट सी इज रूट टू ए बट और पार्टिकल्स आर टचिंग along the face diagonal this is the length of the the closest approach between the two particles so this will be half of the face diagonal that will be closest approach is equals to root 2 a divided by 2 how much it is see here this is directly a but this is a by 2 half of the a so this will not be our closest approach here ill particle gulu just near the rodilla ill end of particle gulu near the vent thangi because It is a divided by two, isn't it? So, either length half and then either other. I am not going to know it. We can take root two a divided by two can be written as root two into root two. So, root two root two cancel out. A divided by root two is our answer. Okay? So, in FCC, the closest approach between the particles is a divided by root two. See, where is the answer? This is not our answer. This is not our answer. Yes, a divided by root two. option c is our answer so like this simply you can solve the problems okay thank you so much